Arizona DHS reported more than 17,000 new cases yesterday, but no new deaths. So far, 9,000 people in our state have died from the virus. Right now, 93% of Arizona ICU beds are taken with more than 60% from COVID patients alone. And amid the spike in COVID cases, a major school district in the Valley is bracing for teachers sick outs this week. Students in the Chandler Unified School District head back to class tomorrow, but will they have their educators? Team 12's Matt Uris joins us now with this developing story. Good morning, Matt. Good morning, Rachel. And yeah, hundreds uh, of possible sick outs are expected or even being braced for here by the school district. This comes, this information was released through the district. It comes after a survey uh, around December or so that uh, found Education Association shows 65% of staff members do not feel comfortable returning to school in person. Instead, most preferring to implement virtual learning since Thanksgiving. Arizona has had more than 160,000 new coronavirus cases, and health officials warn that numbers will likely continue to climb following Christmas and New Year's. Over the weekend, the state superintendent of public education, Kathy Hoffman, called on Governor Ducey to invoke a two-week quarantine for all schools, pushing everyone online. Take a listen here. We can't ignore the data and I can't stand by when there are literally thousands of Arizonans dying every couple weeks. That the superintendent there of public education in a statement, the governor responded telling 12 News uh, that the governor will not consider Hoffman's request, saying it's a local decision and online options are available now just hours from now, really. Uh, Chandler School District officials are going to meet. They're going to take a look at these benchmarks and the recommended learning models where the numbers are where they are right now. As of last week, this is based on state guidelines. It is recommended that every single district in the state move to virtual learning. Stay with 12 News as more information comes out of this meeting. For now, live in Chandler, Matt Uris, Today in AZ.